Is there an art to jumping out of a moving car? You will probably be told that you should jump forward, following the law of inertia. But let's understand how accurate this statement is and what really defines a safe jump. When jumping from a moving car, we inevitably follow the laws of physics. At first glance, it seems that by jumping forward, we will increase our speed by grabbing the tail of the accelerating car. But think again. After all, due to inertia, when jumping backwards, the speed of the jump compensates for the speed of the wagon, helping us land with less force. So why does everyone decide to jump forward? It turns out that the choice of this direction is due not only to physical laws, but also to intuition. When falling forward, we automatically put our arm out, minimizing the risk of injury, unlike falling backwards, where the probability of bruises and injuries is much higher. It is also important to consider the biomechanics of the human body. By jumping forward, we follow the habitual rhythm of walking and running, preventing falls and reducing the risk of injury. So, the reason why it is safer to jump forward from the car lies not so much in the law of inertia, but in ourselves. Clearly, this rule does not apply to inanimate objects. A bottle thrown from a car forward is more likely to break on impact than one thrown in the opposite direction. Therefore, if you have to jump out of the carriage for any reason, having thrown out your luggage, you should throw the luggage backwards and jump forward. Experienced people, streetcar conductors, controllers, often do this. They jump backwards with their backs facing the direction of the jump. This has a twofold benefit. It reduces the speed acquired by our body by inertia and, in addition, prevents the danger of falling on the back since the person jumping is facing the front side of the body in the direction of a possible fall. So despite contradictory physical laws, intuition and habit dictate that we jump forward, choosing the path of least risk and greatest safety. Remember, before you decide to take a risky jump, your safety should be a priority.